Hi, my name is Matthew. I am 14 years old and I am currently in year 10 at high school. I have ADHD and Erlen syndrome and sometimes I find meeting new people, remembering lots of information and changes to my routine tricky. I have just finished working with the mental health support team in my school as I was struggling with anxiety. I had lots of support in primary school and my move to high school went well. However, when I started in year 10, I noticed that I was feeling nervous all the time. I worried about lots of things such as what if I miss the bus and what if I don't do well in my exams. I used to get really upset thinking about all the things that made me anxious and sometimes I struggled to speak. My school helped me by providing a safe space where I could calm down. I have a key worker, Mrs Howard, who checks in with me and she told me about the mental health support team. Mrs Howard spoke to their team and I was referred to their service. I met one of their EMHPs, Becky, for an initial assessment. I felt really nervous and my parents told Becky that I might struggle to speak in the assessment. So she brought along picture cards and I was able to use my cold overlay for any worksheets. At the end of the assessment session, Becky offered to work with me in school on an intervention called worry management. We learned about my worry cycle and strategies that I could use in managing my worry. Over time, I became more comfortable in the sessions and began to talk more. Becky also met with my key worker. Mrs Howard and my parents for sessions so they could understand my anxiety and help me on the days I was struggling more. At the end of the intervention, Becky and I created two visual boards of all the things we had talked about. One stayed in school and the other came home with me. We also created a calming box with all my favourite things inside so I could use this on days where I felt overwhelmed. It's been a few weeks now since our final session. I use my visual boards all the time and I've got an appointment with my ADHD nurse soon. My anxiety can still be triggered by the unknown and I still become quieter around others I do not know. However, my family and I have learned ways to get through these moments. If you are experiencing anxiety and want some mental support from the mental health support team, speak up and get help.